Kim here. So once again, please excuse the wet hair, no makeup look, but it is early. It is only like not even eight o'clock yet, which really isn't that early at all to me, but too early to get presentable looking. I just don't see the point. Probably not gonna be leaving the house, not anytime soon anyhow. Probably gonna go to the gym later. I might um, go check my PO box, but other than that, I just don't see the point in getting all dolled up. So we are just gonna have a random vlog today. Nothing at all exciting going on. I did get quite a bit of sun over the weekend. Once again, we have a cabin up at Indian Lake, which is in Somerset. You guys have no idea where that is Whoa. unless you're from Pennsylvania, but we have a cabin up there. It's really, really nice. We finally got a boat this year, so we spent the day yesterday up there just relaxing and boating and lounging and having a really fun day. But now it is Monday. We are back into the swing of things, and I'm starting off my morning with some delicious, delicious tea. This is actually the kind I mentioned in my last video, the Cranberry Vanilla Wonderland. It is a Christmas tea, so you're not gonna find it right now, but when Christmas time rolls around again, stock up on this. I bought like three or four boxes of it, and this is my last box, but it's so, so good. Let's see if it's still too hot to drink. Mm, it's so good, probably my favorite tea. So I'm drinking that. I'm going to take my prenatal. Let me know if anyone else like cannot take real pills. Like, I can swallow a real pill, but they like upset my stomach. So I take these gummies and I like really look forward to them every morning because they're really, really good. So I take two of those, like the sugar coated ones too. I don't know, I get them at Target. They're the generic brand, but they work. So I'm gonna chew on those. I probably shouldn't put those in my mouth as I'm talking because now I'm talking with a full mouth and that's kind of rude, but I did want to show you what I bought at the store yesterday. I am on such a cereal kick. You want to say hi? Say hi. No, your sunglasses on. <laughs> it's not very sunny today, though. <laughs> it's actually really rainy and crappy. Anywho, I've been on a huge cereal kick lately. I make what I call like a cereal trail mix where I mix like some different cereals and then some raisins or nuts or cut up granola bars or that kind of thing. Um, yeah, you wanna hold this one? So Cinnamon Toast Crunch is one of my favorites. That's a classic. You don't want it? There you go, go shake it. And I found this. Apple Cinnamon Toast Crunch is also a blueberry one, but I like apples better than blueberries. So we're gonna try this. Do you wanna try this one? Should we try it? Okay. Let's let's get down on the floor where we do all of our tastings. Can we open it up? Yeah. Okay. I'm pretty excited about this. Not gonna lie. Also, I am the kind of person I do not ever eat my cereal with milk. Like I can't tell you the last time I ate cereal with milk, probably when I was like seven. But I just, I don't know, I like to just eat it regular. Okay, let me actually put you down here for a second. You can look at Annabelle. Is that gonna work? Well, I try to open this. Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah. Okay, I got it open. You ready? You gonna try it first? Looks like little tiny pieces of toast. Is it good? Yeah, okay, she didn't spit it out. So that's good. So yeah, it's just like little teeny tiny toast pieces. Oh, thank you. I guess Annabelle's not a fan, so I'm not gonna eat that one. It's really good. You're crazy. Bro. <laughs> it's really good. I'm not gonna eat the one that she spit into my hand. But yeah, I would get this. I want to find the um the blueberry kind too. My store didn't have it. My store, so it's like my grocery store. The grocery store I go to didn't have the blueberry. And now Annabelle is stepping on my cinnamon toast crunch. Let's not crunch it up too much, okay? All right, so I am gonna make a little snack with this. I'm gonna maybe mix the two together, add some other fun stuff to it. 
and we'll call that breakfast. But yeah, I would say like nine and a half out of 10, almost 10 out of 10, but this is still a little bit better, but really, really good. All right, so me and Annabelle are gonna go to the gym soon. I apologize for the lighting. The lighting in my house sucks, so I have like my one light set up, but now it's like too bright and I just, I hate the lighting in my house, it's awful. But we're just gonna we'll work with it. Um, I just got a package from I Heart Quinoa and I'm gonna show it to you real quick. Annabelle is super de duper excited about it. But what did we get? So they sent a bunch of just like hot cereal quinoa, right. which sounds really good. <laughs> Toasted quinoa. And then another hot cereal. This I think is gonna be really good. I've never had quinoa like that, like right. oatmeal quinoa, whatever. I don't know. But I'm most excited about these little guys. So there's chocolate puffs. And what does Annabelle have? More chocolate puffs. I guess one. Oh, these are dark chocolate. Dark chocolate, pink Himalayan salt. Ooh, Ooh and what are these? Oh, dark chocolate peanut butter. You want to try them? Yeah. Okay. Let's see if we can get... This is turning into a taste testing video as well. Hold on. We're going to open them. Let's see if we can get this set up. All right, so that's as good as this situation is gonna get. Let's get you over here so that people can see you. And what, we're gonna try dark chocolate peanut butter. So they're chocolate covered quinoa puffs. Four, 140 calories, eight fat, 16 carb, four protein, six grams of sugar. Sounds pretty cool. Um, yeah, they just sent me this stuff. Oh, these are ginormous. Look how big that is. I thought they were gonna be like itty bitty teeny tiny. Hold on, I gotta break it in half. Oh. Hmm. It's not real sweet at all. I thought they were gonna be like really small like on the package. They're not, they're huge. They're pretty good. But they're not, they're not very sweet at all. I get a little bit of peanut butter. The dark chocolate is good. Annabelle <laughs> is not a fan, yeah. It's a little bit um, not real sweet, but I, I do like them. You're not gonna like it. Um, it's like crispy crunchy in the middle there but not a ton of flavor in the actual middle part, but the chocolate peanut butter part, I like. Um, so yeah, I think you can just order them online. I've never seen them in stores anywhere, but I am a fan. Annabelle, not so much, but that's okay, more for me. So we are gonna go to the gym. We'll call this our pre-workout snack, and I'll see you in a bit. Say bye. All right, so back from the gym, and this is what I am having. So it's just one of these bread thins. This is just like the Aldi generic brand. So they're like 90 calorie little wheat breads that I really like. And then I have, this is the last one of these, these chicken patties. They're like vegetarian chicken patties. They're pretty good, they're breaded. Um, I prefer the unbreaded ones actually, but I bought these thinking Annabelle would like them. She didn't, but that's okay. And then I wasn't even gonna put cheese on it, but I gave Annabelle half a piece of cheese, so I had half a piece of cheese left. So we're gonna go with that. And I am gonna cut this in half. And then I have this ketchup. This is, I've shown this before, it's the True Made Foods. So it has just like less sugar than normal ketchup. Come on, you can do it. There we go. So 10 calories, only two grams of sugar. It uses like pureed veggies instead of all the sugar. I don't care about sugar, you guys know that, but it is pretty good. Um, and comment down below, are you a dipper like I am, or do you like put the ketchup on the sandwich? I don't know, I'm gonna cut it in half, actually probably in little fours, and then dip it, and that's gonna be Lunch, I guess, whatever you want to call it. I don't really do meals. I just kind of eat whenever. And then I've been trying so hard to drink more liquids. So this is a half gallon and a straw helps. 
and it just has crystal light in it and it's almost gone it's like down to here so i'm doing pretty good it's like a strawberry watermelon crystal light kind of deal and it is really good so i'm gonna go eat this while it's still hot and i'll see you in a bit i just woke up from like a two hour nap hence this look i have been super super unproductive don't really feel that great um i think i might be kind of getting sick my throat hurts can you hear it see hear it it sounds like there's a frog in my throat um annabelle was sick the past couple days still has kind of a cough so i'm pretty sure i just have a cold but my throat hurts and so i texted jim on his way home from work and i said will you stop and get me some pop and some cotton candy grapes because that is what i was craving and look what he did he stopped and he got me one of my favorite pops a diet cherry 7-up i like this too because it's caffeine free so i can drink all of it not have to worry about the caffeine and cotton candy grapes if you have not had these yet you need to find them and you need to buy them you need to buy them all because they're really good, but they're really expensive. They were like, how much were they, Jim? Five ninety nine pounds. Five ninety nine a pound. So they were like ten dollars. And this is not this is not a very big bag of grapes. Like I will eat this in two or three days. But totally worth it. I'm gonna wash those and put them in the freezer because I like frozen grapes. Frozen grapes are so good, right? Dislike. Jim doesn't like frozen grapes. He's weird. They get like slushy and delicious on the inside. Anywho, something else, maybe even more. <clears throat> Definitely, definitely more exciting than the cotton candy grapes. Sorry, Jim. But, um, okay. Annalise, I hope I'm saying your name right. Annalise, sweetest person in the world. She sent me, actually, I think they're kind of for all of us. Munchkin included. Sweet. Waffles and syrup Oreos. I've been looking everywhere for these. Annalise, I have not found them yet. I cannot find them anywhere. She even packed them like so nice and delicately. And she wrote a super, super sweet note. You guys know I don't read letters on the YouTubes. I think that's kind of private, but it almost made me cry. I'm not a big crier, but if I was, I'm sure I would have shed a tear. But um, it was really, really nice. So thank you if you're watching, I hope you are. And you better believe we are going to dive into these. Can I just help? Why don't you just open them <laughs> right now? Annabelle is still sleeping, so maybe that's I'll give her one. <laughs> Wait, you can just, I just want half right now. But I want to show them. So it's a golden Oreo. Oh my God, it smells so good. It smells really good. It smells like syrup in here. Um, the golden Oreo, which are my favorite. I don't really like regular Oreos. Um, by regular, I mean chocolate. Wait, by by half? Did you mean like you're gonna eat the cream half and I get the cookie? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna eat this. No, I want to like break it in half so I get like the middle bite, okay. and I'm gonna eat some more later. Okay. Yeah. Here you go. Here's <laughs> here's Jim's half. Enjoy. No, I was gonna put it back together. Okay, I did, I did. so here's, here's what it looks like. A little focus. Is it focusing? <laughs> there we go. On? It's cream. It's focusing on a little dollop of mapleness in the middle. Now focus back on us. You want to be in it too? Do you want to hold up my arms getting tired? This is tough work. No, don't do that bad angle. Is that a good angle? It's a great angle. I look good. Do you like my hair? Hey. I wish I knew how to do a pineapple one. Maybe someone could teach me. Anywho. All right, let's put okay. it back together now. And break it in half so you, we get the middle bite with the little dollop. You do a dollop of things. You're going to put holding your mouth, aren't you? Yeah. That's how Shane does it. Mmm. Definitely get some maple. I get, taste. I get waffles and syrup. I get that, it's like that crispy outer edge you know of a waffle. It takes a minute, it is. It's like yeah. frozen waffles. Like when you mm -hmm. toast frozen waffles, and yeah, they're a little bit crispy, and then you put lots of syrup on them. Way to go. And syrup. Annalise, yes. you rock. Yeah, good job, Annalise. You get points for this. Um, so yeah, that's it for now. When Annabelle wakes up, maybe we'll get her one. Let's and do she'll it. probably just lick the cream out of the middle. That's right. Which is the best part, so. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And thank you for the grapes and the pop. You're welcome. Okay, bye. Bye. Anybody want to try the cookie? <laughs> it's waffles and syrup. Can you spit the binky out? <laughs> Where are you going? <laughs>
Yeah, tell Sadie, no, no. No. <laughs> That's yours. Are you going to taste it? Oh. Oh. Ah! Yeah, that's how mommy does it too. You got to open it up first. Now eat the cream side. Or just the cream. Yeah, give that side to daddy. You're right. She knows how to eat an Oreo. Is it good? It's the first thing today we haven't spit out. Do you love it? Yeah. I wish you would start saying words. No. I'd say she's a fan of the cream. Can you say thank you, Annalise? Mm, close. <laughs> okay, can you say bye? Can you blow a kiss? Nothing. All right. Bye. <laughs> All right, so we decided to end our evening at McDonald's, mainly because we just really wanted to get out of the house. And tip, if you have not downloaded the McDonald's app on your phone, you should, because we just got a free McFlurry, and all we had to buy was a 99 cent large Diet Coke. And I'm really thirsty. I, even though I hate Diet Coke, but sometimes when you're really thirsty, you just need that carbonation. It tastes good. So, we got, what did we get? The new Rollo McFlurry. Fun fact, I have never ever had a McDonald's I thought you were going to say a Rollo. McFlurry. And I've what? definitely never had a Rollo McFlurry. I've had Rollos. I feel like the rollers are gonna be like really hard though. Here's what it looks like. Mm, they're not really hard. They're really good. There's a whole heck of a lot of caramel in there. So we are going to share this, me, Jim, and Annabelle. And me and Jim are going to share this, Diet Coke. Annabelle's gonna drink some water. Are you gonna eat some ice cream? Tell Daddy to give you a bite. Oh. <laughs> want some ice cream? I just want some water. Okay. No. Okay. Child that turns down ice cream for water. That's okay. So, this is going to be the end of the vlog. We're going to go enjoy our McDonald's ice cream. And I will see you next time. But thanks very much for watching, guys. Give the video a thumbs up. <laughs> wrong Leave us a comment down below. And we'll see you next time. Bye.